Okay, so this is the HMI in which I have created a simple program. If I talk about wiring, as you can see, this white cable is RS232 cable that is connected to my uh, PLC over here. And then 24 volt uh, power is connected to this uh, power jack as well. And then this is the cable that is connected to my laptop over, over here. This, this is the printer cable that uh, I'm using. Otherwise, you can find a cable uh, inside the HMI box as well. For some reason, uh, I, I have misplaced it. So as you can see, the power and communication lights are blinking as well. So which is a really, really good sign. I'm not sure what does uh, TCH mean, the middle light. Maybe it, it could be an error LED. I'm not sure. So I will check it later on. So my model is P1 3070i, uh, which I will select in the uh, HMI Pi Studio software. So once I turn on the HMI, the window pops up. So I've already, uh, you know, uh, made up simple program. That's why it is showing an on off button. If I press on, the output light is turning, which I will show you the uh, how to create your program or design the program uh, later on and the light turning on here, here as well on the PLC right and you can see on the laptop as well just one more thing uh, I'm using this uh, power supply over here 24 volt power supply which is connected to uh, my HMI and my PLC is getting 220 volt uh, directly which we have already co covered in the previous lesson so uh, PLC is can be powered using uh, 220 volt as well that depends upon the model but 99.9% .9 of the time HMI is uh, uh, program, uh, powered up using uh, 24 volt supply HMI takes 0.5 amperes and my PLC my power supply is of around I believe 2.5 amperes yeah 24 volt 2.5 amperes so I have a small multimeter as well too that's our power, power ratings. Let's create our first HMI program using Vcom PLC. Let me set this over here like that. So you keep looking over the HMI as well. And if I go over here to my Pi Studio, this is the software which I've used. Let me go to create and new. So from over here, I can select my model. My model is P1370i, which is written on the back side of the HMI and my PLC model is LX3V that is written on the top of PLC which I we have already covered in previous lessons let me click on yes <clears throat> so my default screen is zero make sure to not delete that because you would uh, face an error I will go to new object button and go to bit switch Now, the, uh, the PLC program that I've created is a simple M0 bit, which are used for momentary buttons on HMI or Nintendo switches as well. So uh, for uh, X0 won't work because that are uh, that is a physical bit used for physical devices. So M bits, memory addresses are used for, memory bits are used for uh, buttons in HMI. And Y0 is a physical bit, which can be used as a read function to display our indication that is being shown over here, right? So, now for the switch over here, let me make it big, add it and make it M0. The interface is really simple, the software is really simple as well. I will click on momentary and response time is generally 100 ms. Now I will go to new object button and bit lamp. Add it, it is a read address so it would be Y0 over here and everything else seems fine i'll compile it if i face any error it would show an error over here so interfaces generally like wintech and delta software so on the top there are a few functions on the left side it is project tree on the right side objects i am unable to drag my objects right now uh, maybe i'm uh, not able to make it work so i'm using right click so in that maybe i'll explore this further as well because this is the first time uh, I'm using this software to make sure how easy it is for me as well. So now I will click on download. PC to HMI. 
it would take I believe a few seconds to make it work I go back to my Vcon PLC editor because we are monitoring as well and as you can see the program has been loaded so if I make this like over here so if I use my tester like that and as you can see it is turning on the output is turning on using HMI button on my PLC and it is being uh, you know turning on the monitoring is on on Beacon PLC editor software as well so you can monitor from there as well so as a first time user I'm I feel uh, the software is free the interface is really good it's simple not that advanced but it is simple easy to use and that is what the HMI is built for right to uh, make a simple HMI for operator uh, to be used uh, uh, you know uh, in an instant that can be programmed easily that can be uh, replaced or modified easily and uh, software interface is simple as well obviously we can make advanced HMIs but generally we prefer that on PC versions like their Siemens HMI which is advanced I, I believe Vcon uh, might have and will definitely have uh, PC based HMIs as well we, we can explore that in future lessons so we have successfully created our first HMI program using uh, design our first HMI program using Vcon HMI and Vcon PLC and Vcon softwares thank you